Yeah, enjoying another warm day out there. Temperatures are really mild. So the high clouds really haven't stopped us from warming up. We're at 51 currently in Omaha. Lincoln sitting at 55, 54 around Red Oak. We have some sunshine making its way through some of that high cloud cover in the rest of this evening. Really looking fantastic. Very comfortable. We in the 50s through 5 and then that drop back into the mid 40s by about 7 p.m. You'll notice a bit of a south breeze out there. That's going to start to pick up as we get into the day tomorrow. And that's going to keep that warm weather around another couple of days before our next cold front swings through. It'll bring in some changes for us by the end of the week. And as you get out there tomorrow, in addition to the warmer weather, you'll also notice quite a bit of wind with gusts as high is the 30s to near 40s into the afternoon. I'll time this out for you on the hour by hour forecast and break down that potential for a few showers coming ahead of our next cold front coming up. John, warm days, but probably won't be as comfortable as what we're enjoying out there today. We do have the cloud cover around, but overall the wind has been relatively light and that changes as our next cold front makes its approach. So starting tomorrow, much gustier. We were looking at that wind forecast not too long ago. We're talking about gusts through the day into the 30s to near 40s as that cold front gets ready to swing through. That front is also going to bring the potential for some spotty showers starting tomorrow afternoon. That'll continue on into our Thursday and then Thursday afternoon our cold front swinging through that'll cut our warm up short in the afternoon and leave us with a much cooler forecast by Friday. For tomorrow, however, another really mild day, even warmer than today. We're starting off in the low 40s at 7 a.m. The cloudier sky is really trapping in the warmth, so we get a head start tomorrow. That south wind helps us to warm to a high of 58 around the metro. Mild, but quite windy. We'll stay windy by 8. Slight chances for a few showers moving through, especially by the evening, but overall not looking like a washout. So if you are trying to get outside tomorrow, enjoying the 50s to 60s, I would say the main hindrance is going to be the wind, not that chance for showers. A high of 59 around Plattsmouth, 60 tomorrow in Lincoln, 60 in Red Oak and Shenandoah, 57 around Tecama. Let's talk about that potential for showers as we move through the day tomorrow. We do have the cloud cover around, very similar to today. It starts to thicken up by the afternoon. After midday, we can't rule out a spotty shower. You can see that approaching from the west, but we'll see our best chances by the evening. Really hit or miss. All in all, rain totals through Thursday, likely staying under a tenth of an inch for most of us. So this is really light rain. Rain chances will continue on and off Wednesday night into the first half of Thursday, likely most dry once we get past midday on Thursday afternoon. So looking forward to a little bit of a change moving in. High temperatures on Thursday still going to be quite mild ahead of the arrival of that cold front a high of 57 and then drop back into the 40s by Friday. We'll stay breezy with a high of 48. Lower 40s expected over the weekend and our overnight lows will take a dip as well. We're dropping back down to the 20s. From there an overall cooler pattern is going to persist for the rest of the 10 day forecast. We'll stay in the low 40s on Monday, slight warm up on Tuesday to a high of 44 and then cooling back down Thursday, likely our only day where we fall into the 30s. Can stay on top of the forecast by downloading